Hey, what's good YouTube? It's Josh here coming at you with some pretty exciting Yu-Gi-Oh! news today. Uh, we have all of the cards that are gonna be on or gonna be in the 2017 Megatins. There are some amazing reprints too. So I am on the Card Guys Facebook page. I know Italian Yu-Gi-Oh! also shared it. There's already been some videos made too of this awesome set um, about this list, but yeah, I thought I'd, you know, definitely share and let you guys know about it. So, uh, starting off with the secret rares, we have Ghost Ogre, or Ghost Reaper and Winter Cherries. That's a, I'm very excited for that. I know it's not used a lot right now, but I just think it's an awesome looking card, and it's still, you know, a good side deck option for, against some decks. We also have Drowning Mirror Force, Blue Eyes Twin Burst Dragon. Um, yeah, there's Blue Eyes and Dark Magician support in here, so I'm very excited for both of those. Um, those reprints were definitely needed. Dark Magical Circle, Cosmic Cyclone, Magician Navigation, Starving uh, Venom Fusion Dragon, that's awesome. Totally awesome. Pretty awesome as well. Uh, Dimensional Barrier, that's probably what I'm most excited for. I don't have any barriers just because for a while there, they were really expensive, and uh, I knew they'd get reprinted eventually, so I kind of held off. Um, but yeah, very excited for Dimensional Barrier. Also, Zodiac support, even though they are probably going to get destroyed by the ban list. We'll see, but I just have a feeling that's going to happen. But it's still cool. Uh, you can easily get um, Zodiac if you want to try the deck out for a few more weeks or so. Uh, but yeah, so Dried Emperor, Barrage, all of those. Foolish Burial Goods, Full Force Virus, and then Sea Monster of Theseus. So there's just a bunch of awesome secrets in there. For the Ultras, again, awesome cards. We have Dragon Spirit of White and the White Stone of Ancient, so it's kind of cool to see those. You can get Hollows now, because they were commons in the, uh, was it the legendary decks? I think they were commons there. So, you know, if you have those, you can upgrade, get some, get something shiny. Uh, Lecter Pendulum, okay, that's, that's okay, I guess. Uh, Star Dust Cipher Divine Dragon? I don't know. I don't know what that card is, but sounds cool. Stardust Dragon is awesome. Uh, Masterpiece the True Draco Slayer. True King, um, I think that's the blue one, if I'm not, the water one, if, uh, if I'm not mistaken. But, yeah, and then we have Shirinui Solitaire, Black Dragon, more True King support, uh, let's see, we got Zodiac Thoroughblade, Odd Eyes Raging Dragon, uh, can't forget the Mithrium, the Metal Foes Fusion, Tiger Mortar, dark contract with the entities and then for our supers awesome cards here as well we got pre-preparation of rights magician of dark illusion uh toon dark magician and magician's rod more metal foes cards paleozoic uh let's see full metal foes fusion rat pier and whip tail and true king lethosagum that's an awesome one to get too uh, for rares, I don't know, there's just a whole bunch on here. Uh, we got Kaijus, DD, and Metal Foes, um, Predaplant stuff. Just a whole bunch of stuff here. Um, Broad, or Borbo, uh, Lost Wind. Lost Wind's good. Ancient Gear Reborn. And then for the commons, again, bunch of cards here. Ancient Gear stuff, uh, more Predaplant stuff. Uh, the Christrons or whatever, Metal Foes, uh, Gofu, that's probably going to be the most, you know, want popular common. Uh, we'll see what happens with the ban list, because, you know, using his tokens to link, that's it's kind of interesting. I don't know if they're going to let us keep doing that, but hey, you can do it right now, so pick up your Gofus in these tins. Uh, Red Warg and Gardna, uh, Magician's Robe. Yeah, there's just a whole bunch, Paleozoics, mm, more Zodiac stuff, Bunny Blast, Ram Ram. Uh, but yeah, that's about it. There's just some awesome cards in here. Comment down below what you're most excited for from these tins and what you're hoping to get. Also, I'd be interested to hear on cards you thought would be 
were going to be in here, but unfortunately didn't get reprinted. I'd love to hear what you guys think. Also, hit that like button and subscribe for more if you want more Yu-Gi-Oh! news, updates, and deck profiles and openings. Feel free to uh, subscribe. Yeah, and uh, I'll definitely be open opening these tins up uh, once they are released. I'm very, very excited to uh, see what we can get. We'll test our luck and go from there. But anyways, guys, thanks again for watching. I'll speak with you guys soon. Until next time, peace out and have a good one.